From the studios that brought you The Wolfman, The Waker Man, and The Snowman, comes the latest installment in horror films with the word man in the title of it. You guys have heard the stories about this town, right? What are you talking about? There's been 25 murders in the past 10 years in this town. All unsolved. What was that? Someone's back here with us. Guys, this is getting scary. Oh, okay. It's a police officer. Um, hi, officer. Uh... No, guys, it's okay. He's just a police officer. Guys! Guys! guys. No, guys, that's no police officer. That's the... 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 What? 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 Ah! Ah! It's the policeman! Ah! This is not hard to believe. A cop is trying to kill us! Yeah, they're all murderers. Haven't you seen the videos? Guys, he had a butcher knife. He's not a cop. That's what we're saying. All cops are murdered with shiny badges that they use as a pass to kill people. I should know. I'm black. No, I'm saying I think he's a serial killer dressed up like a police officer. <laughs> you have the right to remain silent forever. <laughs> Seriously, needs to be like a better vetting process when hiring police. Yeah, and stricter federal standards. Like for instance, in San Diego, California, the police academy training lasts six months, and other states it only last six weeks. You tell us who's going to be more prepared to deal with high stress situations that call for in the moment decision making. Okay, look, those are good points, but it doesn't even matter for this guy because he's not a cop. <laughs> Ten four on your death. <laughs> <laughs> Gary, I guess you were right. He totally was a serial killer. Yeah, no shit, Sue. 